Let's all just get along. That's what we need to do because everybody was cool with each other before, and I miss it, man. Because we I miss, all... I miss having conversations where everybody doesn't make it f political. We should all just cry and hold hands. I didn't say that. Ah, uh, magic in the movies. Yes, sir. It's better and better. <laughs> What's up, Hog family? Welcome back to another reaction here at Three Shades of Whatever. We're back with Tom McDonald again. You haven't met Tom yet, have you? No, but I want McDonald's. I'm hungry. Not me. That's straight poison. Son. It is poison. I'm starving, bro. Yo, I'll boy. make you a, be a McDonald's better than that shit. Yo, you know what you gotta try when you go to McDonald's? You gotta try this thing that I do. I go there, I order me a Big Mac. And leave before eating. Smart no man. meat, fish filet, instead of the Big Mac meat. Okay. That, fish, that, that, I, I, I can see that. Fish fillet with the Mac just made it exactly like a Big Mac. Try it. I, I can see that. Because all awesome. the stuff on the Big Mac. Now, wait a second. Hold on. Is that just Thousand Island dressing? Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's not secret sauce? Mm -hmm. yeah, it's a secret that it's stuff that is Thousand Island. It, it, it is a little different. It, it is a little different. Dude, I'll but, make yeah. that shit in my kitchen right now with no problem. It is so simple. It, you it chop up some pickles. Different. You get some fucking white vinegar, some freaking Why mayonnaise. Why chop up pickles? Mustard. Relish is... Chop pickles. No, no. To, to make it the real way, you got to freaking. You don't want to. Do, it's not relish. It's not relish that they put in there. It's actual pickles. Relish is actual pickles. But not the same way. Okay. It's like sweeter. And there's relish there's other shit sweeter. mixed in there. Peppers and all sorts of other stuff. So. Okay. I am Mr. Culinary. Like you, know, you, you want to test my cooking abilities, bro? You better check cooking whatever coming soon. Mm -hmm. Well, you should have some hors d'oeuvres here. <laughs> <laughs> Sheeple. Buy a t-shirt. Tom McDonald. Buy yes, please. The link is in the description. You see what he's wearing? Merch. You see what he's wearing? They're wearing merch. We have it in the description. And I'm telling you, there's something down there you guys will like. Believe me. Uh, That's what she said. <laughs> Had to do it. He did do it, too. He did Had it. to he, do it. He put full effort into that, man. It was, it was such a maximum good, effort. It was such a good... <laughs> it was so easy to lean into. I had to let it savor for a second, and then I had to say it. But I kept it between us. I put my hand like this. That means nobody's going to hear Nobody it. Nobody so. else is going to know. Okay, so... All right, Sheeple, what are we dealing down with Down the Tom McDonald rabbit hole we go again. Sheeple, uh, well, so far, what we've heard from him, straight fire. Straight truth bombs galore. This guy does not mix words when it comes to that kind of shit. He says it like it is. And I haven't heard the guy lie yet. No, not at all. No. Even though, even though in, in the comments, we've seen some comments coming through. You know, we've lost a couple subs. If you're going to react to Tom, this racist man, I, I, we won't be a part of it. I have to, another channel, I have oh, to wait. stop so watching. So he's like, he's a, he's a, oh man, what, he's a controversial figure. Is that Correct. where we're going? He's controversial. Please don't get butt hurt easily. They are so butthurt We love easily. everybody. Not, no, not all of our subs. But there was a few that they bounced out all because right, we reacted to him. For I, the, I'm the black guy. I wasn't offended. For the, See? For the easily but easily but hurted people. Yes. Uh, who, we There's love everybody. We don't really care. I don't care what you do or who you are. Uh, let's see what he has to say. I agree. And then we'll be, uh, I mean, with a name like Sheeple. Sheeple. <laughs> I, yeah, listen. We need more Sheeple. Yeah, yeah. There are a lot of Sheeple around. There listen, are, here, here, Here's the thing. We're not allowed to debate anything anymore. Because if no. you debate certain topics, you're just called like a bigot, racist. You're condemned thing. instantly. It's like you're not allowed to even have a thought. No, no. And then, we when, have to listen and believe what everybody else wants us to think and believe. And that's it. So no free will sounds anymore. Sounds like a if, dictatorship. But that, that is, wouldn't that be sheeple? The people that get mad if we don't like what they like. I think so. Sheeple message. Just saying. Oh, let's get into it and see what he has to say about it. Humans been controlled since the day that they were civilized. The truth has been so heavily politicized. If you don't know who's controlling you and killing all the little guys, find out who you're not allowed to criticize. Black folks who were never ever actual slaves Fighting with white folks who ain't actual Nazis Controlled by rich folks who use the news to make hate While elite folks control other political parties It's a big lie, trying to make you pick sides Trying to make you burn the cities down and kill each other They got sick minds, big lies Deep on the police so that there's big crime To take away our freedom to restore order they let die Play with people, turn men into women Make the counterculture mainstream to mix up the system Change the pronouns, if gender is a spectrum so is privilege I know poor white folks and black celebrities with millions they starve you with a lack of information and only give you facts through a branded corporation distort your worldview with an algorithm that changes based on propaganda curated for your engagement holy we can't fuck be dude yeah, he said a lot in just whoa a yeah take it take, yeah, he take had a shirt lap shit. he said a lot in that little bit of time right there we can stop now we, yeah we can stop we, now. we really could 
We've Sheeple, really got, message. Yeah, message received loud and clear, Tom. Exactly. Loud and clear, Tom. See, the thing is, what people don't understand, he's saying what everybody's scared to yeah. say. He that, really is. That's what it is. See, you know, the people, they, they, they rebel <laughs> <Olé>! against it. <laughs> they rebel against it <laughs> when they don't have the heart to say it. Yeah. Now, all right. I'm not going to agree with everything he says, right? If you don't have to agree. To be, I don't expect if, you to. If, if people, he did say like they're trying to mainstream counterculture in the, you know, with the trans stuff. He mentioned that. I do not care what you do with your own body. I don't if you're of either. sound mind and sound age there and you, you want to make a decision, you do what you want. I have no problem with Same here. anything. Pe- Leave I'm the a fucking big kids believer. out of it. I'm a big believer Leave in. Leave the kids out of it. Mm-hmm. I'm a big believer in do what makes you happy. Mm-hmm. If you know something makes you happy, Dude, I voted. Do I was it. one of the people in Cali back when that big fucking vote happened about gay marriage. It was like in 2007 or 2008. It was a huge fucking deal in Cali. I was right there backing everybody up saying, dude, do you. I don't give a yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, who I cares? Don't care. let, let gay people be as miserable as all of us. But I anyway, agree. Um, but the stuff that he said, the way he's saying it, the way like the media pins everybody against each other, mm-hmm. it's it's true, man. It's, I, I, it's actually kind of hard. Do people even really listen to mainstream media anymore? I feel like it's starting to become a thing where most people are just like, yeah, I, don't. I do think that we the don't know what to believe. Don't. We don't know. What I don't know what to believe ever. We and don't. honestly, this is what I've noticed. People get like a biased standpoint. We'll call it politicized, whether it's Democrat or Republican. And they they do something called like um, confirmation bias where yes. they just look for what they want to hear. Their ears turn off when it's something they don't want to hear. Correct. And then their ears turn on when it's something they want to hear. So you're obviously going to get the left watching a certain channel and the right watching another channel. No one's actually really listening to the opposing view whatsoever. Nobody's mendable. Everybody's just like he said. Nobody critically, th- nobody critically thinks anymore. Yeah, no, they're just no, like, I, they blindly follow. Because there, there's people out there that are going to say what they want to hear. They're not really going to think about... They cre- create this agenda and expect us just to jump onto the bandwagon. Yeah, they ain't You know? It. But here's the thing. You're not allowed to even speak on the nuances. It's it's a nuanced thing. That's the problem. We can't have a conversation. Like, I can't, like, for instance, if I say, because I wholeheartedly believe that if you are a natural man who turns into a woman, and yes, I will call you she, whatever you want to be called, sure. uh-huh. but if you want to compete in a woman's sport, no. I just don't agree with it. No. Now, yeah. it's like, if either. anybody said, now somebody could be like, oh, you're just a bigot and you're hating. That's not what that is. Stop labeling people who, with just the words hate and bigot when they just try when to nuance, agree. have a nuanced conversation. Because there's so many people who are, they don't hate and they're not bigots. They're just giving you their opinion well, on okay. something. Okay, yes. so if you got a daughter and your daughter decides she wants to be a female boxer and Mike Tyson decides he wants to be a female, are you going to let your daughter fight Mike Tyson? Hell, Hell, to the- Hell no. Uh, Matter I ain't no. fighting Mike Tyson this if he was a I woman. Ain't fight. Exactly, so guess what? <laughs> yeah. That's still Mike Tyson. Nah, man. So you can't say, it's easy for you to say when it ain't your ass out there fighting him or one of your children or somebody that you love. Put somebody else out there, man, that's suicide. Yeah, you can't. Yeah, and then you, then you have the issue with giving hormones to kids and stuff like that. that Listen, I, I'm totally against that. People, That's abuse. Pe- what That's people the are doing, what, the, what these people are doing, they're trying to, to come from a standpoint of a utopian world. But they don't realize that their utopian view actually has a lot of bad things that could happen biologically. If you, you can't give hormones to young children, first of all, children don't know. No, I don't want to hear that anymore. Stop they it. can't go to war, they can't drink a fucking beer, but you're going to tell me that they can decide what they are. So, Come unfortunately, on. it's not as utopian. It's an agenda. It's, it's bananas to me. It just doesn't, they, like, I'm not trying to hate on anything. I don't hate on anything. Everybody can do what the fuck you, you want. want. You see, remember, everybody, STFU movement. I want you to keep hashtag Hashtagging <laughs> STFU movement because I'm over it. I don't give a shit. I, people do what you want. I am totally fine with you doing what you want. There was a person in Florida that was given hormones at a young age. It stopped the growth of their actual private part. They mm-hmm. were a man, a biological man. It stopped the growth of their private part. So when they became actually old enough to say do a reversal surgery, there wasn't enough of the private part to actually do an inverse on the surgery. And that messed that person up completely. So there's reasons biologically mm. that you could say not to do it. I agree. You're allowed to disagree. But be, if I say that to somebody, please don't call me a hater. And this yeah, I'm not hating. I'm just talking... My opinion. Yeah. You I know? just want everybody to and, go back to shutting and there the fuck are, up and being cool. There are plenty of actual haters uh-huh. out there. There are, there are plenty of people. But at the end of the day, I feel like the people who who don't hate are it, it greatly outnumbers the people that do. Yes. And it, the media will make it seem like that little square on your 
You, you see know, what you did, Tom? Wall. Mainstream to mix up the system, change the pronouns. The gender is a spectrum, so is privilege. I know poor white folks and black celebrities with millions. They starve you with a lack of information and only give you facts through a branded corporation. Distort your worldview with an algorithm that changes based on propaganda curated for your engagement. We can't be free. Can't have no peace till we're on the same team, but y'all are sheep. Blue the screen's just part of the machine. Y'all are sheep. Been writing your brain, controlling your mouth. You say lit, fleet, bet, cap. They trying to dumb you down. They endorse whatever narrative is popular to shout and use minorities in movies for diversity clout. Two sides on the spectrum, but ain't none of them honest. Took the red pill and the blue pill, spit them both in the garbage. Being woke used to mean you understood you're a target. And now it's having two good legs and never taking a step forward. If you agree, it's free speech. Disagree, it's hate speech. Erase it if it came from anywhere except the mainstream. Trump supporters labeled as the racist, but they can't be. Lincoln was Republican. And that's who ended slavery Science been politicized, it's easy to see A mask became a symbol of which side you believe But you'll never cure a sickness till you cure the greed Because the problem with our natural immunity is it's free Society is broken, want you locked inside a cubicle Addicted to pornography, liquor, and pharmaceuticals Tell you that you're fat and poor and you were never beautiful Then tweet how much they love you when they hear about your funeral We can't be free he really does say a lot. He says, he a, says lot. a whole he says a lot. fucking lot, dude. There is a one little part, and again, I don't want to get into these nuanced political conversations. There's one little thing that I could kind of say I understand what's happening with representation in movies. I actually do agree with it to a point because okay. when you're when you're I a young really child a shit, of whatever, honestly. yes, you want to see what you are on the screen. You, Why not? You want to like have that sense of like belonging and see like absolutely you know oh oh you know like say if you're a young black girl and yes. you see a movie and and with black girls in it you yes. know that is going to help sure i have, people I have no feel issue accepted. with that anybody who has an issue with that has a small mind shut the fuck up right the only see, again, the only time it gets brought up is sometimes when it's it is forced in a sense like they, they it's it's like bad in a way yeah. where it's forced but I do, like, he mentioned that, how he disagrees with that idea. It seemed like he was saying he disagrees with that a little bit when he was talking about, like, the movie diversities well, in I don't, movies. You, I mean, everything I, he says, we don't have to sit here and, like, act like we agree with. I, I don't, there's been things in other songs he said that I don't necessarily fully agree with. But the, the this truth that he spits. Uh, there's a yeah, lot of it's, it. There's a lot of it's, truth in it. It's just and and most of what he's trying to say is we should all just get along, really. That's actually that's what he's the message. saying. I agree. That is absolutely the message. But they don't, message. because guess, cause guess what? If, they, if we don't like what they like, then we're the enemy. That's fine. Like, he said and, that. And, and so a he, lot he, of these things that's going on now, like half of this stuff that they're hitting us with now, I ain't never heard of this shit until the last... Five, six, seven years. It hasn't even been that long. You can't just make something up and now it's a thing. Yeah. You yeah. can't just do that. He also said what I was saying prior yes, to... Yes, 100%. He said, when you disagree, it's hate speech. Yep. Yep. And that's fact. That's, that's what I hate Me too. the most. Same it's here. Like, it's like, oh, if I disagree with something, white supremacist. Well, it, like... I'm allowed to have a thought a, without is, being a fucking is, hater. Isn't that a dictator? Yes. Oh, he said dictator. I thought you said he was a dictator. Go ahead. I'm, 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 I'm sorry. <laughs> well, that's, we're not talking about your Tuesday nights. <laughs> Well, don't mess with our Tuesday <laughs> But yeah, let's finish this up. All right. <laughs> if they can't convince you, they confuse you. They want you dumb and dead. They divided you by race, religion, income, and sex. Made everybody right and left. The hatred got so intense. If the other side likes oxygen, you'll put a bag on your head. And the conspiracy theories labeled as misinformation is just a terrifying truth that scares the hell out the nation. The system treating you like trash and you got rifles to aim with. Just imagine how they'll treat you when your guns get confiscated. George Orwell, 1984 was his last lecture. George called them thought police, now we call them fact checkers. Government surveillance trying to catch you, they don't ask questions. Mass incarceration equals capital for cash investors. The system isn't broke, it's working fine. Oppressive and chaotic is how it was designed. They say if we ain't doing nothing wrong, there's nothing to hide. While their agenda and intelligence completely classified. They don't teach you rights in school, you never learn them at all. Cause they're easy to remove if you don't know what they are. The only people you can rule are the criminal ones. So they force you into corners till you're breaking the law. We can't be free. Can't have 
have no peace till we're on the same team But y'all are sheep Lucas screams just part of the machine Y'all are sheep I, I, listen, I, they don't want to listen to time because you're going to mess around and learn something. Yeah, yeah. But am I the only one that was waiting for all those little white things to chase them? Like, yeah, I, I didn't know what was going to happen with that. I, thought <laughs> I was were, waiting that they was going to chase them. Just kept reminding yeah, me, like, 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 like our robot. robot. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I thought our robot was going to happen. They was going to just run down on him or something. Yeah, I think the premise is absolutely... Is spot on. on. Yes. On. Yeah, it's right like, on. let's stop fighting over this dumb stuff. Dude, That we've said that pretty much and, and, every Tom McDonald reaction. And that's the crazy so part that it's going to always be that instigator to, Maybe to, to a stir point, it up. And, so there point. is. The one thing I will say, though, it seems recently because of the advent of like YouTube media and people like Joe Rogan and stuff like uh -huh. that, I feel like the mainstream media is people are really starting to finally say like there it's it's a bunch of lies. Because, like, I feel like it all went downhill when they did the whole, like, when, I don't, the the Joe Rogan thing with CNN, with the... Oh, yeah, 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 when they tried the, to... Dead with the COVID ivermectin? Shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. That was a That was that so, was dumb. so, so bad. bad. It was so bad. That was so bad. They were like, oh, he's taking horse dewormer, and it's not. It was human pills. Yeah. I Listen, they didn't have anything for COVID treatment. No. So he was basically doing everything. Yeah. CNN took a video of him and shaded his face. I remember. Pale gray. I remember. And said, like, he took horse dewormer. Do you, he's fine, right? So if an antibiotic... Is he you, fine? If you, if you give amoxicillin sure to a dog, fine. do you call that dog antibiotics? No, it was made for people first. <laughs> an ivermectin syringe for a horse is like this fucking... It's a, it's a, uh, <laughs> They're not even close to the same. And th it, it's just... Oh my that God. just made me shiver, like... This shit is so dumb. It's just like, why even lie that much? And yeah. I feel like he called it... No, I'm not saying I agree with well, every single thing Joe Rogan says, but I'm oh, saying I that don't. was that was an obvious, like, come on, see. And yeah. this is actually a conversation, especially on this channel, that I avoid... I'm talking about it now. I avoid these conversations. Yeah. I have zero political conversations. I'm yes. a non-political person. Yep. So How about that? I'm you just, got a conversation out of me that I don't even usually have in public now for all these people. You see. fuckers. I love everyone. Does that matter? Yeah, I, I can't say that. But This reminds me when Bret Hart was like, W. I got, you know, C I have my picks. W.